and it's white outside. Snow, it's absolutely beautiful. Snow, it snowed guys last night. Look how beautiful it is. I can hardly see it, but it's so pretty. It's so pretty. It's so sticky and I've got to go to work in it. Oh, oh, I can't wait. Let's go check it out. Fluffy snow everywhere, absolutely beautiful. Probably not the best day to go driving in, but uh, we all have to do what we have to do. Just be careful, just be careful. So I'm way today, what am I doing? Oh yes, no, start with the car, the car. I went and seen the new skip car yesterday. That sounds terrible, that, but a vehicle that I could pack full of stuff, run into the skip whenever, whenever required. I mean, it could be more than that, but that's gonna be its prime use. You know, which is really important, believe it or not. Went to go see that cheap little run around. She's actually, she's actually really good. It's got, it's automatic, but it's got the, the, I'm not into cars at all. The, the stick lever thing. It's like American, you know what? When you see, we go. So that's gonna be, that's gonna be fun. That's gonna be a good laugh. But, but uh, so that's 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 an all go. That's 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 uh, I've uh, signed on the dotted line or whatever you call it. You know, that's it. So I'll go. So, but today I gotta go do a quick wee job in the morning and then I need to nip to the garage because apparently I've only got one light, one headlight. I'm uh, I'm missing a light on the left hand side. I'm just showing you this, the snow. This is absolutely beautiful. Slush on the roads though, which is, which is thinking this is proper sticky snow. See if I get finished early today, I'm gonna go home and build a snowman. <gasps> Who wants to build a snowman? kids will they'll love it good morning guys so today we have been woken up by ariel who started screaming that it's north pole outside because it's so snowy not quite north pole but we do have some snow so i've literally jumped into my clothes put some makeup on to just you know kind of get ready for the day and uh <laughs> guys want to say hi? hello it's snowing well yeah. it was snowing yeah and it's oh. so snowy especially in the front it's the whole path is covered in the front maybe we should go in the front should we? Because I've saw like a bunch of snow there. Oh no, I watch. I've got coffee. Bah. <laughs> no way. Bah. Should we go to the front? Took my morning coffee outside. It's not even that early to be honest. I'm, I keep talking that it's super early. It's not. It's like half ten. Yeah, but I've because, uh, oh, because my best mommy here, <laughs> she took us out very very early. We basically yeah, yeah. we just woke up. You just woke up, yeah. We just got everything ready and we went outside because she yeah. thought you don't know how this is gonna last. You don't know how much. Exactly. Well, come on, you're gonna try and make a snowman. But can we maybe go to the front? I don't know if this kind of snow is sticky enough though. But this little man here has actually never seen snow. Um, a few days ago it was snowing for like two minutes so he's seen little snowflakes but but he's not seen snow snow and obviously with all the restrictions we can't travel to within the nearby place I mean I, it's weird because the travel restrictions were in before the full lockdown was put in place and uh, I'm pretty sure that we weren't supposed to travel anywhere however I've seen that everybody was going um, around the new year everybody was going to like Abbey Moor and stuff and I was like how are they allowed to do so but apparently everybody was as long as you were from the same area we never went because we thought that you know you're not supposed to be leaving anywhere which you're not because the resort the resorts that apparently were mobbed and that's obviously not good for the whole pandemic but now we're in a full lockdown so we can't go anywhere I'm kind of hoping that you know the, the lockdown is supposed to be till end of January maybe we could go somewhere in February if it's snowing I don't know but I mean that's fine at least they can play some in the garden oh no and we're lucky oh, to no. have this gigantic garden so we well that's the thing if it snows we've got a big garden to play with the snow don't we yeah, so oh, no, we can basically never... Oh. I've got snow in my boot! Oh, you do? Oh, I think I've got snow a little bit on my arm! <laughs> oh my god, it could be a broken snowman! <laughs> I think I remember, we were in Poland, and Dad and Patrick, and all of us, we made a gigantic snowman! Yeah, that's actually the last time we've seen like proper, proper snow. That was before Noah was born, so we're talking quite a few years ago. We went to Poland, especially to have the snowy Christmas. Well, after Christmas, it was the beginning of January. It's okay. Anyway, as I was saying, oh, oh no! So we very stupidly left the strawberries outside. I told Darren all the plants are supposed to go into conservatory. He left the strawberries and look. They've turned into ice. And why did he not take it inside? I told him to take every single pot inside. <sighs> anyway, as I was saying, that was that few years ago was the last time we seen proper snow. We went to Poland. We went to Warsaw, which is where I'm from. We spent some time with my dad, and then um, and then we went to Zakopane, which is like 
up in the mountains, a proper snowy resort. It was beautiful. It was amazing because it was there was so much snow, but it was still warm. And I really wish you could go again because you're kind of guaranteed the snow. But obviously with the whole situation, we're not. And to be honest, I'm not really wanting to go to Poland because ever since my dad passed on, it's I don't think it'll be nice for me because that's going to be the only thought that's going to kind of surround me if I was to go there. Anyway, uh, I'm going to finish my coffee. Kids are playing. Snow's not sticky enough to make a snowman though, so that's pretty sad. Right, that was quick. That was extremely quick actually. I mean, it's only a bulb, you know, but just in it. And okay, yes, it's uh, really simple and I can do it myself. But the good thing is I do work for a lot of car garages, especially this guy. And he's absolutely just spot on. Is that goodbye or something wrong? Oh, goodbye, okay. <laughs> okay. All right. Yeah, right, okay, so. Job one done, car garage done, back to the office. Back to the office. Got a number of things to do today, because it is a Friday, folks, it is a Friday. Number of things, we'll get get that done, and um, I don't even know if we own sledges. Who's got sledges? Me and Q? You know, Ariel would love to, to oh, it's 40 mile an hour here. Ariel could pull Noah around the slide in the, in the back garden. Oh, just, I love having a garden now, folks. For years, for years and years and years and years, we just had just a, a pokey little concrete back garden. And it's just, uh, you know, you couldn't really plant anything unless it was in pots and all that type of stuff, which is fine for some, but I wanted to, like last year, grew veg. Oh, it was fantastic. Made a, made a raised bed of pallets, you know, reclaimed pallets. Just, you know, afternoon thing, you know, nice and easy. Oh, it was, it was you know, it's just uh, having the option, you know, I'm, I'm speaking about, you know, planting in ground and then I'm talking about a raised bed. But I used the ground too. Used the ground, we did, you know. It was it's ab just fantastic, absolutely. Zero degrees outside. Zero degrees. Bow, 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 bow. B and Q's all out. Apparently they had red and blue ones there, but they were in the clearance section, which that's where I remember the red plastic kind of cheapy ones. And of course, if they're in the clearance section, they don't just disintegrate, so folk will buy them and stick them in their loft. So now I'm gonna go try Halfords and Home Bargains, because now that I've got it set in my mind that I need a sleigh, don't really fancy going home without one, even though I've not promised anybody one. But you know, it's, it's one of those things, you know, you, you tell yourself you're gonna get one. So I'm gonna go get one. I just uh, hopefully I'm I'm I'm, I'm past it because I've already it's what time, what time is it now half ten we've done it guys we've done it everybody's like what what are you all screaming about but what I'm screaming about is a company that I didn't think was going to be open because they sell clothes so I thought that was a non-essential place but apparently they're doing the whole click and collect so I'm maybe just totally lost with this whole lockdown thing but anyway they've got a pink and a blue one so I phoned them in booked it and I went down to pick them up. Maybe see if I've got gloves for the little man too. Because we've only got the cozy ones, you know, the woolly ones? Or the nice twisty ones? But that's no use when you're working with snow and... <laughs> Sue, the better half, who's going to be editing this. Uh, so she'll probably leave this bit out. <laughs> has told me that there's no point. Well, actually, I well, yeah. She says there's no, 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 no point. You don't need sleighs because it's already melting. But, you know, five minutes of fun is better than no five minutes of fun. <laughs> well, that was a more than a few minutes, but it was successful. Got the sleeves, got some waterproof gloves, and got the coffee shop. Look, they got Santa Clauses. Santa Claus. Don't want to put this though. Don't want it spilling. What we'll do is. I wonder if there's other words for slush. You know, so when all the snow and everything's on the road and that thing, and it all starts to melt, and then it all gets gritty and grey and depressing and sludge, slush, whatever type of thing. I've only known it as slush. I think that's the only word I've ever known. Let me know. Let me know. That's another one for you. Let me know what you call it. And I'm talking about in English. Hey, you want to put it in any language that you're, you're watching this? That is, that you're more than welcome. I'm looking for some cool things. You know like the Eskimos have got like, a hundred words for snow. You know that type of stuff? I, I just wonder if we have a, uh, oh, battery's flashing. I wonder if we've got anything for more than slush. Different parts of the UK. Cause they will, they will. There'll be some cool names. Oh, I'm actually sliding. 
Oh, that, that's a sheet of ice. Oh, I just drew, I just, I just drifted there for a few seconds. Hello. <laughs> Hello. Noah's having his hot chocolate and a bit of iPad time, and Ariel's having hers. She's sitting with a cat playing some Roblox. Yeah, because um, I I don't know what happened last time, but something happened, so I wasn't allowed to play anymore. And then I told no, we needed the Xbox Live account, which is on a different thing. But anyway, it's sorted. Having some chill out, cozy time inside after all the playtime. Yep, and I I am quite cold. And uh, for me. Not so much chill up time for me, I need to tidy. So the house is still a bit of a tip after Christmas cleaning. I still have some boxes to put up in the loft, hoover in, de dust in, and I need to change some things in the living room because Noah's toys, there's so much toys. And I think I'm gonna, and because in this corner with all the plants that I showed you before, was a Christmas tree. And before that, there was like this big piece of furniture with his toys, which I don't really want it anymore. I think I'm gonna bring in like a little cube storage because his toys are, well, I'll show you where they are. They're everywhere here because he's continuously playing and this chest is nice here because you know when it's closed it's all compact nobody sees it but all this on top I do not like so I think I'm gonna bring in cube storage here get rid of this last few Christmas things and sort it nicely so it's all pretty but he still has toys here because it's absolutely pointless keeping the toys only upstairs because the kids are downstairs in the living room majority of time but yeah lots of tidying up lots of things to do <laughs> So maybe, no, I'm not gonna have a coffee because I just had a coffee from Symposium. So yes, I think I'm just gonna sit for a few minutes and then start tidying up.